My dear beloved child, I understand your heartfelt desires and the things you have been praying for. Know that I am attentive to your prayers and I hear each one of them. However, there are certain requests you have made that I will not grant at this moment. It's not because I am indifferent to your needs, but rather because I have a divine plan for your life. Just as I had a different plan for Peter and his friends when they were fishing all night, I have a special path designed for you. Like this video if you believe Christianity. While you may not receive exactly what you ask for, trust that I have your best interests at heart. My plan is one of prosperity and blessings for you sometimes. What you believe to be the best thing for you might now align with the greater purpose I have in mind. So have faith in me, for in due time, I will bless you with the very best outcome that aligns perfectly with my divine plan for your life. Keep praying, stay steadfast, and be patient, for the perfect moment to unfold the blessings is on its way. Your trust and belief in me will guide you through the journey I have laid out for you. Remember, I love you deeply and my plan will ultimately lead you to a life filled with joy. While you may not receive exactly what you ask for, trust that I have your best interests at heart. My plan is one of prosperity and blessings for you sometimes. What you believe to be the best thing for you might now align with the greater purpose I have in mind. So have faith in me, for in due time, I will bless you with the very best outcome that aligns perfectly with my divine plan for your life. Jesus says, type Amen if you're looking for me guidance. Listen up, dear child. Satan wants us to be afraid, I'm not talking about the healthy kind of fear that keeps us safe, but the kind that fills our minds with worst case scenarios, crippling our courage and blinding us to the beauty of the Lord's plans. Wow, we're entangled in this fear. The enemy steals our purpose and dismantles our dreams. Are you struggling with fear in any area of your life right now? Perhaps a relationship is causing anxiety or a seemingly unsolvable problem is weighing on your mind. Take a moment to pause and speak the name of Jesus. Proclaiming his name brings power, protection, and a fresh perspective that crushes fear. Subscribe to the channel Help me to reach 250,000 divine subscriber. Remember, fear may be a potent adversary, but faith in Jesus empowers us to face and conquer it. So, whenever fear tries to take hold of you, rely on the strength and peace that comes from knowing him, and watch as your worries begin to fade away Trust in his plan and purpose for your life, and fear will lose its grip Five on Bible you. Bible verses listen this carefully today. 1. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and do not rely on your own understanding in all your endeavors. Acknowledge him, and he will guide your paths. Proverbs 3 to 5 to 6. 2. I am capable of all things through him who empowers me. Philippians 4.13 3. We understand that God works all things together for good for those who love him and are called according to his purpose. Romans 8.28 For dot makes seeking the kingdom of God and his righteousness your primary focus and all your needs will be met. Matthew 6.33 5. Because God loved the world so much, He gave His only Son, 
so that everyone who believes in him will not perish, but have eternal life. John 3.16 Jesus declare, sometimes, the only way to get through a challenge is to press through it. Pressing requires effort, focus, determination, courage, and commitment. There is no doubt that being delivered from a difficulty is often easier than having to press through it, but easier doesn't necessarily mean better. It's in the pressing that your faith muscles are developed and you're strengthened for your purpose. God has not abandoned you, rather he is preparing you for what he has already prepared for you. So, don't settle, don't quit, keep pressing on. Remember, you're closer to overcoming than you might think. Have faith and trust that God is with you every step of the way, guiding and supporting you through your challenges. You are being equipped for the path ahead, and as you press on, you'll find the strength and resilience you need to fulfill your purpose. Hold on to hope, for God's got you in his loving hand. Subscribe to channel to grow this community. God is trying to lead you somewhere new. Do you feel it? The pull in your spirit, the desire to up and run, the strange feeling that things can't remain the same. The fear, the change, it might feel scary and unsettling. You might be unsure, but don't be. He's leading you somewhere new, and it'll be marvelous. Push through the fear and get excited. A new beginning is on the horizon. Embrace the journey with faith and hope, for God's plans are full of wonder and purpose. As you step into this new chapter, know that he is by your side, guiding you and providing for you every step of the way. Trust in his divine wisdom and love for he knows the path that is best for you. God says, type Y-E-S if you want my blessings. Even though change can be daunting, it often brings growth, blessings, and opportunities you may not have imagined before. So, don't let fear hold you back. Embrace this new adventure with courage and enthusiasm, knowing that God's hand is upon you. Your future is bright and amazing. Things await as you follow his lead. Keep your heart open and you'll discover the marvelous possibilities that lie ahead. Today's message, God wants you to quit being so negative. He wants you to stand in faith. He wants you to be bold and courageous. He wants you to tell your problems who your God is. Negativity can weigh us down and hinder our progress. God encourages us to embrace positivity and focus on his promises. Stand in faith, knowing that he is always with you, ready to guide and support you through every situation. Be bold and courageous in the face of challenges. Instead of being afraid, trust in God's strength and provision. He has equipped you to overcome obstacles and achieve great things. When problems arise, don't be discouraged. Speak with confidence about the greatness of your God. Declare his power and love over your circumstances and watch as he works wonders in your life. Remember, God is on your side, and with him, you can face anything that comes your way. Embrace faith, courage, and a positive attitude, and you'll find the strength to conquer every difficulty that arises. Type how men if you believe in God's mercy and blessings. I hope this message finds you well. I wanted to take a moment to remind you of how much you mean to me and to remind you of the love and hope that Jesus has for you.